Hi, so you know what's stressful about birthdays? Being in charge of the birthday cake photo. Okay, you can do this, Nat. You are going to capture this moment. Here it comes. stressful than any of that, it was my birthday on Sunday and as the cake, you know, candle blower outer, I was in charge of cutting the cake. And do you know how stressful cutting a cake is? A lot more stressful than it should be. Okay, you can do this Nat. You are going to cut this cake. There's 12 people. So if you cut it in half that way and then half this way and then divide each quarter into three, you are going to nail this. You're going to cut this cake into very even pieces. Everyone's gonna think it's great. Actually, Nat, I don't think I'll have any cake, but thank you. Oh, okay, cool. I mean, I'd already counted, and now it's uneven, which is kind of hard to cut. In a, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's cool. I, I'll forget about this. And also, I'm gonna share a piece with Janine. Oh, okay. Cool. So, now it's even again. Okay, I'll just... Oh, and Nat, I just want a small piece, so don't cut me anything too- It's birthday cake, just shut up and eat it. Oh no, like that's too much, that's too much, I couldn't eat that much cake. Just a smaller amount. Okay. No, smaller. Less, less. A little bit less. A little bit less. Yeah, that's great. So much. You know, it always bothers me when people ask for cake because I'm like, do you know how hard it is to move this kind of stuff? It's like a construction site, you know? First piece is good, you got sound support everywhere. Second slice is like a murder scene and then you just end up serving people this weird, horrible mess. You know what? Don't look at it like that, okay? It's birthday cake. It's not a chore, it's a delight. I don't know. Obviously the pressure is on when you're cutting a cake, more so than when you take the photo. The worst part about the photo though is that you can't just do this. Wait, sorry, I missed it. If we could just, okay. Sorry, just one more time and everyone just act like it was the first time. I liked the tears, they were good. All right. Yeah, I don't know, it's weird. I have a strange obsession with getting photos where you can see the person blowing out the candles but the flames are still there. Because once it's extinguished, people won't know what's happening in this photo, Natalie. Who knows, maybe this happened. Hey Rebecca, eat cake and die. What does that mean? Where did this cake come from? Why aren't the candles lit? <laughs> Got the shot, the money shot. Pew, 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 yeah. Oh yeah! And I guess that's an indication that it's time to wrap up this video. And I apologize because I just realized this whole video is about how stressful I find birthdays. Birthdays are so stressful, life is super hard. You know I'm only joking, right? You know I, I, I know that's a stupid stress. It's like on a scale of 1 to 10, a 10, anyway. Hope you guys are well, and now it is porno music slash comment time. I just want to say I am incredibly upset that so many of you admitted that you were the kind of person who would take an umbrella. That is so dis- Do you go to shops and just take dogs that people tie outside of poles outside? What- Who are you people? Do you go to airport security and just kind of take whatever luggage off the car? It is a sign of madness, and I- I- I don't know what to say. And yes, it was the umbrella that cost me $40. I can't believe so many of you remember that. And I can't believe that that's what I tell you. I, I spent a, a, $40 on umbrellas. How stressful are birthdays? Life is hard. Life is super hard. I turned 30, by the way. <laughs> oh no.